Hello, I'm gonna be filming a home workout tonight. Just one larger dumbbell for this one, okay? It's gonna be mostly cardio core focused. Okay, we're gonna get started in the center of that mat. We're recording their second bench ramp, so it might be a little echoey. Those arms are gonna reach up. Let's lean to the left, back through center, to the right, and come on back. We're gonna bring the shoulder blades down the back here. Last two. One more, and those arms come down. We're gonna go into those lateral lunges, sending the hips back. I'm recording this literally at 10, 20 at night. Had a family dinner after work and just feel like I've been sitting down all day today. So just wanna do a quick uh, cardio focused one. Last two, one more here. We're gonna bring those heels in right into those sumo squats to start here. Down and up, we squeeze the glutes at the top. Down and up. Driving the knees out in line with the toes. Last one. Come on down, we're gonna pulse here. Also got some new bands today and I feel like when you buy new bands, I don't know what they're going to do until you open the package, but not that great. So we'll see. Get a little bit lower. Four, three, two, and one. We're going to come down. We reach overhead. Those arms come up. We're squatting down here. We're not leaning forward. One more. Back through center. We're going to squat. We step to the side. Down. Heels together. Just adding a little bit more mobility here. Down, step together. We're gonna just pulse it out again. Four, three, two, and one. We're gonna add a half way to come up. Little pulse. Up, one, two. Last one. And let's get those legs a break. It is a warm up. Come to the back of the ball. We'll walk it out. Whew. Four mountain climbers. Three, four. Let's walk it back. Those arms reach up. Fold forward. One, two, three, four. Walk it back. Two more here. Two, three. Four, walk it back. Legs stay straight. Last one here. We're gonna walk it out the bottom. Stay with these mountain climbers. Four, three, two. We're gonna go for cross body next. Knees the opposite elbow. Good job. We have that down dog coming up. Driving the knee up and over. Four, three, two, and one send the hips back. Pedal it out. Bring those heels down to the mat. Let's float the left leg up. Bring the knee to nose. Hold here. We float back. One more time. Knee to nose. That leg comes through. We drop the back knee. Elbow comes down to ankle. Open up and rotate. Good job. One more here. Hand comes back down, frame the foot. Come to our high plank position. Let's go 10 plank jacks. Popping those feet out. This can also be a tap, right and left. Three, two, and let's set those hips back. Woo! Two, and one, we float the right leg up. Bring that knee to nose. Float back, one more. Knee to nose, that leg comes through, we drop the back knee. Elbow down to ankle, open up and rotate. Come back down, frame that foot. We're gonna walk those hands back towards the feet. Come on up, okay? Give those arms and legs a shake. We're gonna jog it out on the spot. Shaking all four limbs here. Four. Three, two, ready to some buckets, let's go. Bringing those heels 
Four, three, two, and one hands to the chest and open. Ankles, this can also be a step. We extend those arms. Four, three, two, and one. Arms come up, drive the knees to chest, elbows down. Good job. Four, three, two, and one. Last move here, we're going to go for some good mornings. We send the hips back, squeeze them to the top. Just warming up that back body. Last three, two, one more rep. And rest. Okay, we're going to get started here right away with the body weight cardio set. Okay, in four, three, two, those arms are going to come up, just like we finish. Bring the knees up, elbows down. We're going to the feet here. Two, and one, we're just going to squat down and up. We squeeze the glutes at the top. Down and up. Good job. We're going to add the knee to elbows. We come down, drive the knee up. Whew. Last one here. We're going to come down and pulse in that squat position. When that feet drops, we're going to go for some squat jacks. So the feet are going to hop together and we hop back to that squat. Get a little bit lower. Three, two, and one. The feet come together. We squat. So a little in and out. Good job. Quickly bring those feet in. Let's add a jumping jack here. We come up, jack to that squat. Jack to the squat. Out in squat. All right, we're going to come down to our squat position. Little calf raise squat. Up and down. Catch our breath here. Up, little pulse. Woo. Come on up, give those legs a bit of a shake, okay? The arms are going to come up. We're going to step side to side. Good job. We're going to stay this side, drive that knee up, up. I'll let you know when to switch sides. Four, three, two, and one other leg. That left knee drives up. Dig into that standing leg. We're going back to those squat jacks. Woo. Four, three, Two, and we'll come back to your center. Feet come together, you squat. Good job. We're gonna add that jumping jack, we we'll come up, jack, two, squat. Couple more reps here. Last two, one more. We're gonna come down and just pulse in that squat. Stay low. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and rest. Give those legs a shake. I just realized that I forgot my water downstairs. That's okay. Okay, <laughs> what we'll do next um, is go into a little Interval set. What we're going to do is an EMOM, okay? We're going to grab that single weight here, okay? First move that we're going to do with that weight is similar to that jack squat combo we did. We're going to go for a chest press. So we jack the feet out, 
we squat down, the weight comes between the legs, sort of jack, weight comes out, we squat, weight comes down, out to that squat, press, squat, okay? That's exercise number one. If you just want to do the legs, you're going to go out, in, squat, out, in, squat, okay? Uh, exercise number two, what we're going to do, you're going to tip forward to the hips here, okay? What we'll do, we're going to go for overhead raise, we come up, down, we're going to squeeze the glutes, front raise, we come down, up, down, squeeze those glutes, front raise, okay? Just follow along with me for this one, we're going to do about 20 seconds of each, I'll give you 10 seconds of rest, I'm going to start again, it's four minutes long. Alright, four, three, two, let's go, we're going to squat down, we press that weight away, so it's a squat to a chest press. Down, curl, press. One more. And we're going to tip forward to those hips. Here we go. Overhead raise, we come up, front raise. Tip forward to the hips. Come up, squeeze those glutes. So depending on the weight you have here, this might be super challenging for you for that overhead raise. We tip forward, bring those arms up, then we'll go front raise. Last one. We're going to that next squat in three, two, let's go. I'm not giving you a lot of rest here. Squat, curl, press. If that chest press is too much, you can also do an overhead press here. Down, curl, press. So the weight comes between the legs as you squat. Last two. And come on up, tip forward to those hips. Overhead raise, we come up, front raise. Good job. We tip forward to those hips. Woo. Good job. Squeezing the glutes as you do that front raise. And come on up, three, two, let's go, we're halfway through. Down, curl, press. Good job. I'm gonna change this one up a bit, okay? For the last two minutes, we're gonna go with that overhead press with a high knee. Just feel like that first move is a bit too stationary. Down, curl, press, last one. We're gonna bring that weight up. We drive the knees to chest. So I'm mixing this knee off halfway through. Good job. Driving those knees to chest. We have one more round of this e on left. Three, two, and one. Give those arms a shake. Round four is starting in three, two, let's go last time. Down, curl, press. Good job. Down, curl, press. Five seconds here. One more rep. That weight's gonna come up. You drive those knees to chest. Whew. 15 seconds here. Drive those knees up with control. Here we go, last four. Three, two, and one. All right, that weight's gonna come off to the side. We're gonna give those arms a bit of a break here. What we're gonna do next um, is a similar style set, okay? We're gonna go for four minutes through. What we will do is three exercises, 20 seconds each, no rest, okay? 
So exercise number one that we will do, we're gonna come down, reverse lunge, curtsy lunge, high knee. One, two, up. Reverse, curtsy, drive. If that's too much, you just wanna do the reverse with a pulse, and then knee drive, that's fine too, okay? So that's exercise number one. Then number two, we're gonna get down nice and low. You're gonna come back to your beast position. You come up into that low squat. Beast, so I'm floating the knees, we come up. If that's too much, you can also do a surrender here. Down, down, up, up. That is your option. Last move, we will grab that weight. Okay, we'll be ready nearby. What we're gonna do here is that weighted toe touch. All right, for the last 20 seconds. We're gonna come up, start with that left leg first. Okay, four minute in Three, two, let's go left leg. Reverse, curtsy, knee drop. Again, if that curtsy is too much, you can also just do a pulse to the knee drop. So we're gonna get that heart rate up for that second exercise. Last one. And get nice and low here. We come back to beast and up, or you're gonna go surrender. So we're floating the knees here. We brought back on the heels like a spring. This one's really gonna burn up the lower body. Last one. And come on down. Woo. Give those legs a break. Wave the toe touch. Those shoulders come off the mat here. Bring that weight closer to the feet, straight legs. Three, two, and one. Come on up, right leg back. Reverse, curtsy, knee drive. Woo. Again, always the option just to pulse here. Last one, get nice and low, here we go. Back to your beast, and up. Or you're doing that surrender, down, down, up, up. Last one. Come on down, Ooh, there's a lot of quads here. Weighted to toe touch. Bring that weight closer to the feet. Shoulders come off with each rep. Two, last one. And come on down, left leg is going back. Right into it. Reverse, curtsy, drive. So that standing leg is strong here, helping to stabilize us. I'm going to try and look at the camera here and lose my balance completely. Woo! Last one. And we switch, scroll to that beast, or that surrender. Woo. Good job. Last two. One more round. Woo. All right, we're almost set in here. We have one more round, then I'm gonna give that little body a break. Give the quads a break. Oh, we do a little bit of glutes, but not too much more legs. Two and one. Back up to the feet. Right leg here. Last round of this. Team up. So let's go. Good job. And we switch. Woo. Last little bit of quad work here. Woo. Last two. One more rep. All right, come on down. Oh my gosh, my quads. Here we go. Last few toe touches. Couple more reps. Good job. Last three, two, and one. Before we go into that next set, you can go into that hero pose. Really circle those quads.
squats. You slowly lower back and just move the hands onto the forearms if you'd like. You can come down all the way. Just give the front of those quads a bit of a stretch. That's very quad intensive. Woo. Okay, what we're gonna do next, I wanna get the heart rate up again. So, what we will do here, next exercise, um, what I wanna do is a Tabata set, okay? Going straight through four minutes. First exercise that you are going to do is going to be two jumping jacks for high knees. One, two, one, two, three, four. That's the first 20 seconds, okay? Second 20 seconds, what you're gonna do, you're gonna come down into your high plank position, okay? One, two, three, four mountain climbers, two plank jacks, okay? Similar kind of style. If you wanna hold a plank in between, you can. It's gonna be 20 seconds work, 10 seconds of rest for that active recovery. All right, fun little cardio set here. In three, two, let's go, body weight cardio. One, two, three, four. One, two. Getting that heart rate up. You drive the knees to chest. Like I said, home workouts cannot be sweaty. That's not a lie. Let's go. One, two, one, two, three, four, and oh, we're going down. Let's go. One, two, three, four. Two point jacks. Good job. I'll let you know when to hold that plank. One, two, three, four. And come on out, hold that little plank. Or you rest here, it's up to you. Good job. Two, back up to the feet. Let's go, two jacks. Four high knees. We're doing this one for 30 seconds. You can see realize. And then the last 20 will be for those mountain climbers. One, two, one, two, three, four. This can also be done without the hops by going tap, tap, okay? And come on down. Let's go. One, two, three, four. Two plank jacks, or you tap right and left. Keeping that bum down, hands are right below the shoulders. Good job. One more rep right here. And let's hold that little plank. Squeeze those glutes. Halfway through. Two. Let's come back up to the feet. Woo. One, two, drive those knees out. Good job. Make sure you're pumping those arms as those knees come up. 10 seconds. And come on down, big tour mountain climbers. Woo. One, two, one, two, three, four. Woo. And come on down, hold your low plank, or you take this time to rest. We have one more round here, okay? Two, back up. Woo, let's go. Drive those knees up. One, two, three, four. Woo, it's been four minutes of straight cardio. Ten seconds. Last one. One. Two. Let's go right to our high plank. Four mountain climbers to those two point jacks. One, two, three, four. Hold that plank, last 10 seconds. 
Good job. Three, two, and rest. Whew. All right. I can't believe I'm recording so late. I think I just have a little energy today. Um, okay. What we're going to do next? Um, interval style. Okay. Three rounds, 30 seconds. All right. So it's going to be feeling a little bit longer. We're going to grab that weight again. Okay. For the second exercise. First exercise that you're going to do, um, we're going to do that alternating squat jack, okay? So we'll do regular squat, feet are parallel to a sumo squat, okay? Just like so. All right, if that's too much, you can also just do a squat, we walk out, sumo, we walk in. So your feet go from parallel to 45, okay? That's exercise number one. Number two, you're going to come down, grab that weight, everyone's favorite, this is a wood chopper. I'm trying to keep my arms straight here. I bring the weight up to the side. Obliques are engaged here, okay? A little bit of core action as well. Then we're gonna drop that weight, okay? What we'll do for our last move, we're gonna come up onto the back. You're gonna go for those roll ups, Woo, okay? So we roll onto the back. Use that core, drive the momentum up, you come up to a hop. We roll back, okay? Use that core, come up. If that's too much, I swing at the the roll back action, so you're going to go for a leg raise, you bring those hips up, okay? That is your nod there without the hop, okay? Ooh, it's going to be a lot of core. In three, two, and let's go 30 seconds here, we squat to sumo. Your modified version looks like this, we walk in, squat, we walk out, okay? Good job. 10 seconds here. Woo. Last one. Come on down, my right. I'm gonna go bring the weight up to my right side. My left leg is down here, okay? You can just mirror me. So straight arms here if possible. that way up to the side. Last two. One more here. And that weight comes off to the side. Come onto the back. We use that momentum. Roll back. Come up to a hop. We come back. Roll onto the back. Good job. You're explosive with that hop. If you need to use the hands to help yourself get up, that's completely fine. You're using that core to propel yourself up. Woo. Again, always the option just to do those reverse crunches. Last one. This is a surprising on core for this move. And rest. 10 seconds rest here. In three, two, and let's go. Squat to sumo. Good job. Quickly bring those feet in together. Try to make this more blue focus, not quad. Sorry, just run the quads. We have that wood chop next. Right foot's going down. Come on down. We're going to bring that weight to the left. Up and down. We're not swinging that weight, we're bringing it up with control. Whew. For this last round, we're going to split the wood chop, so we do 15 seconds in each direction. One more here. You drop that weight, come onto the back, roll back, use that momentum. Sometimes it might help if you hug those knees into the chest here. Good job, you're almost there. Last breath. Woo. And rest. We have one more round here. Okay, 
okay? And then I'm going to do uh, a finishing set and we'll call it a back, okay? I don't have been a long one in a while. This filming is kind of late. I promise I'll do a long one in a few days on the weekend. Okay? Three, two, let's go. Squat to sumo. You quickly bring those feet in together. Good job. 10 seconds here. We're gonna do 15 seconds each side for that wood shot. Last squat. Come on down. Woo. I'll let you know when to switch sides here. One more on this side. And switch. We're not swinging that way, remember? Last three, two, one more rep. Weight comes to the side, come onto that back. Let's go, roll ups, last time. Hug those knees in. Less than 10 here. Whew. Last breath. And rest. Whew. Okay. We are going to do a finisher set here, okay? I'm going to go body weight, so I'm going to bring that weight up to the side. Um, we'll do a three minute finisher here to round it off, okay? Three different exercises, three seconds straight through. You know the drill, no rest. Okay? So, first move that you are going to do, okay? I'm going to go into those uh, sprinters, okay? So, I'm driving that leg up. 30 seconds here, so we'll do one round each side, okay? That's exercise number one. Number two that you're going to go into is a squat jack, jack to a sprawl, okay? So, we jack the feet, squat, squat to sprawl. Okay? If that's too much, what you're going to do instead, you're going to go squat, squat, we step back, step up, come up, squat, squat, step back, step up. Okay? Last move that you're going to do, we're going to come down onto the back. Okay? You're going to move those alternating V ups. Okay? That last little bit of core. Okay? I think I might add 30 second point at the end. We'll see how we do. Okay? Last little bit of work here. In four, three, left leg's gonna go first. Let's go sprinters. Driving that knee up. That hop is totally optional, okay? Woo. 10 seconds here. Last two. And one, come on up, we squat. Squat to sprawl. Again, you can do this one without the hops, or you can do the squat jack version. Whew. Last one, Woo. and flip it over. V ups, just to make sure it's no joke. <laughs> Reach for that opposite foot. Bicycle crunch is a great modification here as well. Less than 10. Two. One more rep. Come on up. Right leg is going for that sprinter. Back and up. Woo. Good job. We're almost there. Ten seconds here. 
Thank you and have a great night.